everybody chan shady's here and welcome back to another video today we are here in off road outlaws because as you guys know the latest update to off road outlaws has been out for quite a while now and everybody has been messing around messing with everything from the forwarder to the the new jobs to the trailers to just everything but i feel like the thing that everybody has pretty much forgotten about until just recently, mainly because people have to take time to find it, obviously, are the barn finds on the map. So, with that being said, I have got the location to the Oldsmobile 442 location, and we are be going to go ahead and picking that up and finding that in this video. Now, I decided to go ahead and whip out the Bronco with the flatbed trailer here, a because it just kind of felt right seeing is how this is the um the vehicle that i found every single other barn find in so far or at least just about every other single barn find but also because of the fact that um the fact that um i feel like the bronco is probably one of the best vehicles i have in my garage other than the fact that it's still on stock compound tires um for going and doing this kind of stuff so if i check the map here i should already be i'm already relatively close to the area i basically just have to like oh there's a lock box can i okay i need to get closer to tap it there we go two grand from it too that's actually not too bad but um i should already be like relatively close to it from right here I may need to climb on top of the mountain, though, just to be sure. Oh, see, I was literally just about to say that we're probably going to have to go in the drone mode to find it. I was literally just about to say it, and then there it is. Okay, th thank you, Amelia. I'll watch it in a second. I'm doing a video right now. But, um, there it is right there. Oh, yeah. Yep. There it is. Let me go into drone mode real quick. And, yep. There it is right there on that lower cliff. That's the Oldsmobile. Oh, yeah. That's definitely a 442 front end. 100%. So, um, for anybody who wants the location on the map as to where it is, there you have it. Literally right there. So, right below that yellow line right there at the edge of the mountain. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and I can't click on it from the drone, right? Yeah, no, I can't click on it from the drone. So, let me return to the truck. And see if I can kind of finagle the camera here to be able to. Yep. Got it. So with that being said, the old mobile has been claimed. So let's go ahead and um take that thing back to the garage and let's go ahead and just build the heck out of that thing. I mean, we're doing soup. We're going balls to the wall with this thing. You know what? You know what, actually? I just remembered I haven't really made any sort of like NASCAR style builds yet in this game. I know a lot of people make like NASCAR related stuff, like the, the most recent car show winner actually had kind of like a NASCAR type vehicle. So I think I kind of want to do something like that. Like, look at this proper napa know-how a napa auto parts you know nascar type things so that's so that's what i think i want to do with this thing let's go ahead and um restore for i think it's 500 gold right hope it is they better not have changed the price um yeah there we go 500 gold see i, I have 3200 because i've been grinding this game a good bit lately so you know we're set I'm pretty financially set in this game for a pretty good while. But if my game would go ahead and load and stop being um, really weird. Come on. There we go. 
There's the Oldsmobile 442. Very interesting rear end. Um, very nice front end. But with that being said, let's just go ahead and um, let's go into body customization first to see what we can do to this thing. So side steps, no. Roof lights, no. By the way, in the next video, I'm going to be finding and building a charger, and I plan on doing this to it, actually, making it into an old cop car, so stay tuned for that. Um, no cages or nothing like that. Fenders. These fenders actually don't look terrible, but I still don't think I want to run them. Keep the stock ones. Wings, yes. Ooh. Ooh, they have a ducktail for it. That's cool. And the other big wing from the uh, Camaro or whatever it is. If I'm going for a NASCAR style build, I guess I could do the duck lip. The duck lip, the duck lip kind of looks best on this thing anyway. So yeah, why not? Let's do the duck lip. Horns, obviously no. Exhaust, ooh. I kind of dig that actually. Side pipes. Crazy hood stacks. I recognize those from the Cuda. And then obviously the regular like tips out the back. I'm gonna I'm gonna run these. Cause I actually really like these. Usually I'm not a fan of like up pipe exhaust like that, but I'm, mm, I'm actually kind of a fan of those. Let's see. Nah, I'm not doing that. Light, no. Jack, no. Winch I'll do for functionality. Headlights, no. Repair pack, yes. Tow mirrors, no. So that's what we're going to be doing to it initially, at least. Now, real quick, while I'm thinking about it, let me go into um, upgrades. Engine power. Yeah, just all the way up. Grip, all the way up. Weight, all the way down, I should say, because it's weight reduction. Durability all the way up. Not diesel swapping it. Um, I could put an e-brake on it, but I'm probably not going to worry about it. Supercharger? Yes, because I want to cut out the hood. There we go. That's nice. Oh, do I want to cut out the hood? If we're doing a NASCAR style build, I guess I shouldn't cut out the hood, so I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. Let's see now. Tuning. Tune suspension. If we go in the back, am I able to do like independent suspension? Nope. Not even close. Okay. But I'm guessing I can in the front. Yep. So I can do independent in the front, but not in the back. Okay. That's fine. Tune suspension front. Rear, go ahead, travel, bring it all the way down, front and back, and of course, stiffness, we're going to put all the way max, because that's how I always do my own street cars and stuff. That's how I basically do all my vehicles now in this game, just make stuff max width. Not going to mess with axes, well, I'm going to make sure it's like reset all the way to zero because i want my tires to be like as wide as possible even though it's not really going to affect the grip in this game anyway and honestly let's literally just do that and call it a day because like that's already like almost perfect right let's see with with well, yeah, let's do it like that. Let's do it like that. I think is what we'll say. Quick dyno run. Let's see what this thing's doing with the supercharger. Oh, no, I already have enough runs. We are putting down 1170 and 878. So pretty similar to almost all the barn finds. So um, let's see. Next up, 
obviously this is probably going to be a challenging part we got to got to put a nascar style paint job on this thing so oh wow i don't know what it is about that yellow but it really pops i'm gonna i'm actually gonna run that yellow yeah i'm legitimately gonna run that yellow because why not go ahead and apply that yellow so that is saved then um decals what do I put? Obviously, I got to put the um, Chan Shady's YT on here. And by the way, with the with the latest update of the game, I forgot there was an update where they had some bug fixes. But um, they fixed that glitch I was having with the text before. Oop, I didn't mean to duplicate. They, fi they fixed that glitch that I had with the text before in the forwarder video. So um, I can actually type now. So, of course... Chan Shady's YT. Let's go ahead and put that down here on the side. Because, of course, I got to promote the YouTube channel. I think I'm going to make it black, actually. Because, why not? Let's make it black. Yep, it's first order of business. I think this is going to be a yellow and black themed car, pretty much. So next thing I want to do, let's make, let's give it a black hood. Shapes, uh, square. Take this and we're just going to just make it nice and fat. Like that. And that's... Yeah, that's already perfect. Wow, that's literally that's that took no time at all, and that was literally perfect. I'll take that. Um, don't want this video to be too terribly long, so I may do like most of it in the video, and then like end it halfway through, just so just so you guys can see the finished product. Obviously, you guys got to have um sponsors and stuff on here, so I'll just put. Let's put Simpson on here just because. Now I'll go right there. Let's put Raptor on here because why not? Let's put um wouldn't really make sense to put Shelby on this thing, I don't think. Let's go ahead and put it up. Oh, yep. I do want to do that. Let's take a Nas sticker, put it on the back. Oh, I forgot to make this stuff mirror. Okay, hold up. Um, mirror. Really, I don't have to make this mirror, but I will anyway, just because mirror, mirror, and mirror. Yeah, all that's copying on the other side now. Good. What's next? Um, Flowmaster. So that's going to fit pretty well on this car. Right. I feel like this car would sound pretty good with some Flowmaster exhaust, right? Right. Totally. Let's just do fast. I don't I don't even know what half these sponsors are by the way. I'm just throwing random stuff on this car. Like the most random stuff I can think of basically. Edelbrook cuz why not? They're pretty iconic. Start putting them above the Chady's YT now. Comp. Oh, comp cams. Oh yeah, that's going to be helpful. <laughs> it's going to be helpful in the races. Russell Like I'm scared that I'm that I'm accidentally gonna put like two different exhaust companies or something like that on this car and it's gonna be really sketchy. Fuel tech and summit are going on here. Let's put fuel tech up here on the door actually. Let's make it black. Summit. 
No, let's put Summit on the trunk. That's what I'm thinking. Let's, let's turn it like sideways and yeah, like that. There you go. This is kind of starting to come together now. Kind of. Real quick, I want to take the um shapes. Let's take like a just like a really long line or something. I didn't oh, okay. I thought it thought it gave me a triangle for a second. I was like, boy, what are you doing? Let's make it black. Nope, that did not work at all. Okay. Yeah, no, I, I just think that's not going to work. There we go. That's 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 about what I wanted to do, actually. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. So now I just got to take. Um, say, let's re put fuel tech back on there. Right. Got to actually got to get the white one this time. And then there was also, um, what was it? Was it comp? No, comp's right there. Oh, dang it. I didn't mean to get rid of comp. Oh, dude, what am I doing? Um, where's comp? Where's comp? There they are. Comp cams. Put it back right there like nothing happened. It was Russell, wasn't it? No, it wasn't Russell. Who was it then, dude? Oh, it was Summit, wasn't it? Simpson, Raptor, Nos. Oh, it was Flowmaster. Okay. I was trying to figure out, like, who else is underneath that, uh, that uh, black layer? It's Flowmaster. So we got to replace Flowmaster on here. Okay. Then real quick. Red and then a white triangle. Yep, there we go. Don't got to duplicate this. Yep, like so. Real quick, I'm actually gonna change that to the square with the um with the rounded edges. 
Yeah, just because of... Yeah, that does look a little bit better. I actually kind of got to replace that NOS sticker now. Or I could just make it smaller and put it farther in the corner. That works too. Let's take this NOS sticker and put it over to black. Because why not? Let's do the Mickey Thompson logo, the white one. Yep, there we go. Mickey Thompson. And I'm running out of designs here anyway, so let's just do... Wouldn't really make sense to do Pro Charger because I'm supercharged. Let's just run this, I guess. Make this text black and put it on the back of here. Nice. Then lastly, for the last design, let's just take let's take BB and T Racing, I guess. Paint it white and oh no, paint it the proper color actually. Yeah, and put that on the hood. Don't gotta mirror this. There we go. Yeah, I think it's fully decked out. I cannot put anything more on here unless I were a member, which obviously I'm not. So, um, yep. There we go. Only thing left to do now is wheels and tires, and I'll be done. Let's see. Surprised my phone hasn't stopped recording yet. I know I've been going for a while now. Let's see, let's take. Let's just do black steelies and black steelies. Yep, there we go. That's a NASCAR. Actually, wait, 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 wait. Just thought of something. Let's make the bead. Yes. Yes, dude. Oh, my God. Yes. Yellow bead to match the car. Yes. Perfect. All right. There you go. That's going to be the finished build of the new NASCAR. So um, probably going to take this thing on the multiplayer server pretty soon and see what I can do with it. But as of right now, that is going to be the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to like, subscribe if you want more. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Talk to you guys later.